Hey, Ellis from Spectora here, and today we're going to be talking about how to create, view, and edit sample reports. Let's go ahead and get started. All right, starting off, we're on the dashboard, and we're going to want to go find the inspection report that we would like to make into a sample report. So we're going to find that inspection by going to our dropdown and hitting inspections, and then typing in the address of what we would like to use. I'm going to use this one. As we pull it up, you're going to want to click into that report. And once the report's loaded, preview publish. Up in the upper right hand corner, you're going to see a drop down called report tools. If we drop that down, you'll see that there's make sample report option there. We're going to click that and it's going to bring up the new sample report box. We're just going to name the sample report and we're going to give it a description. So let's name this one test sample report. And let's give it a description so that whenever your client is hovering over the uh, sample report, it says something for them to read on this. So this report shows a typical home inspection report. And we're gonna hit create. And it says down here in the corner, sample report created. So let's go see if we can find where that is at. On our dashboard, you're gonna go ahead and go to settings. And then there's a sample reports button. Once we click into that, it's going to show you all your sample reports and it's going to give you a few different options on what you'd like to do with them. So you can either copy the URL, the report URL, so that you can put this in your like automation emails or send it however you'd like to your clients. Uh, you can view the report here. You can drag and reorder it and put it in a different spot if you have numerous ones in here and you'd like one to show up at the front. You can also refresh the sample report here, make any edits to the report, uh, like the description or the name of the report, and you can also delete it from here. Um, once you've done that, let's go ahead and open that sample report and take a look. So one thing to point out from the start is it's going to change the agent and the agent's name to be a generic version so that you're not having any issues with uh, that agent that was actually on the report showing up on your sample report. Uh, this is to protect you and your confidentiality and everything. Um, but as you're going through this, you can go ahead and like check sure, check that everything looks good for you. And if like the images are how you would like, or just however you would like to model to your clients of how your report would look. Um, once you're done with that, you're gonna want to see how your client would see this from your public profile. So let me show you how to do that. Starting from the dashboard again, we're going to get to that profile by going to settings, profile, and then you'll notice in the upper right hand corner here, there's a view public profile button. If we click onto that, we're going to see this page from the perspective of your clients. And you'll see underneath your business information name, there's a button to view sample reports. When your client clicks into this, it'll open up a page where it shows your sample reports as well as your business information. And they would be able to click into that report from here and see uh, all the information that you are trying to show off. Um, this is how you can go about creating and uh, making your sample reports. If you need to make any edits to that sample report, I would recommend going to that original report that you're trying to make a sample report of, make those changes there, and then go through these steps again to create your sample report so that it reflects it on your page correctly. You would then wanna obviously delete the old one and your new one would have that up-to-date information. If you have any other questions related to this, don't hesitate to reach out to the bubble. We're always happy to help you. Otherwise, have a great rest of your day.